we're gonna change uh, an aftermarket stereo with the big 10.1 screen in here. Uh, this is a Ford Mustang 2016 GT350, right? Shelby. Shelby? Yep. So what I'm gonna do first, I'm gonna try to take all this plastic out. My first one is I'm gonna try to pry this piece off right here with the plastic tool. I'm gonna start it from here first. And pull it out, pry it out like this. It's got all this clip right here, this three clip. And then next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pry this part out. There's a clip right here. It's a you got to be gentle with this because that clip is so thin, fragile. You can break the whole plastic right here, and that's not cheap right here. Pry that out and go gentle with this right here. You can see right here that plastic is only like see this. You'll break them if you pry it too hard. So now next thing I'll do, I'm gonna try to go like this a little bit, pry it out a little bit easy. You gotta be gentle. Okay. This is all clip, so you pull it out like this, get a good full finger out here right here and pull it a little bit gently. Pull it like this, kind of jerk it around like this a little bit, not too much because if you pull it too much, you're gonna break half of these right here. So once you got that about less than uh, half an inch you keep coming over here with the tool pry this out a little bit right there just make sure you don't go more than two inch you're gonna break something okay I forgot to mention uh, you gotta pry this out too before you pull this whole thing out same thing right here pry this out there's be two clip right there and three on the bottom so now once you pry this thing, once this thing is out, you can try this a little bit too much, you'll break this part. So try it from here again. That's too much too, so. I'm gonna try it from here. Right here. Be gentle. Cut it out. Make sure you're not pulling more than two inches or you're going to break it. Okay, now once you get that out, you go easy because there's a wire in the back for this uh, oil temperature and everything else right here. Push this clip out in and pull it out right there. Once you get it out, you can try to put it right here temporarily so you don't break them. And then now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try to pry all these out right here, and then I'm gonna take this two screw out. This should be like two uh, seven millimeter down here somewhere. Now, I'm gonna take this plastic off right here. You just pull it out, the plastic. <laughs> And then now there's a two seven millimeter down at the bottom. See right that. Take that off. <coughs> now I'm gonna take the top seven millimeter inch out. Put it down here. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this little plastic off, take it out. There will be a 10 millimeter. You're gonna have to take it out so you can slide this whole piece out. Oh shoot, I can't reach it. 10 millimeter. Take it out, one more. Got 
Got that out. I'm going to leave it in there. Leave it right there. I'm going to lift and see what else it's got around here. Okay, once you got that, you I can feel that this thing right here. Now, this part right here is just a plastic on the left, uh, the right side, the passenger side. I'm trying to pull it out like this. It should come out e pretty easy. Only a, a plastic. There's uh, four plastic, five little tiny ones. Once you get that, there's seven millimeter you have to take out right here because this thing, this whole piece, is going to come out separately. I'll take that seven millimeter out. My installer talking about how fat he is. Trying to reach to the back and run the amp, amp wire. So once you get that piece out right there, see this piece will come out. So I'm gonna do the same thing on that other side. I'm doing the same thing to the uh, driver's side. I'm gonna try to use three finger like this and pull it with your thumb like that. It should be easy. Yep, I didn't cheat. Most people pull it out and put it back, but I didn't. So you got seven millimeter right there. Take it out. As you see earlier, when you saw that, I was doing one hand. But my other left hand is taking the video. So what you got right there, this is easy to break right here. Be careful. I'm gonna try. Okay, well now, uh, I got this piece out. I'm going to lift it up a little bit right there. You can see something is right there blocking it. So what I'm going to do, I know there's two 7 millimeter right here. I'm going to take a hook and kind of... Oh, this hook is not working that well. There's another hook. Like a 30 degree hook. Get it in there and pull it. Once you pull that out you see a seven millimeter I'm taking a seven millimeter out one take the other one out two let's see if I can move anything out okay lift this thing up a little bit See if I can lift it up. If not, something else. Gotta get this out some more. Do I'm gonna pry this out? Put this on park. This is a stick shift, so it should be on neutral. I'm gonna take a, a metal pry bar. Any plastic, uh, plastic is better, but it's the same thing. Depend on what how big it is. Don't use a flathead screwdriver though. I'm gonna pop this open like this a little bit. Pop it open. It's kind of hard because it never taken out before. So go like that around. Once you get that up, kind of work with it. So now I'm gonna pull it out. All right, I'm gonna lift this part out, the back out. Hold it right here. I'm gonna just kind of pull it. Let me see if I can break a bit. Oh. Put it, pull it out this way. Yep, one. Do it one at a time because it's kind of hard to take both at a time. Yep, you pull it back that way like that. And then once you get that back out, you basically, well, since you got this two screw out, it should come out easy now. Pull this part out right here. That seven millimeter that we took out. And then everything should come out like this. And you just basically now, just unplug, get the light over here. Push this part down. And then, should be a clip right here somewhere I can't see. Well, actually, gotta get that cigarette lighter out too. 
take a flat head, push it if, if, if it's too hard. Okay, got that one out. So now, same thing as this. You see, so this one you push that part right here. Push it. Yeah, push it right here on the bottom. And then take it out. This thing is right here. You gotta take a flat head. Not that much. And it's gonna be the other side. So twist it upward a little bit and then do this side, the other side. I don't know why they make it so difficult. You can pull on side it like this. Be. You basically push this and this. Put the radio back here for now. Take a seven millimeters. Take all these out. One. Three, four. Now it should be slide out. I'll put it right here now. Pull it out like that. I'm not sure what holding it. I can't see. Let me see. Something holding. I'm gonna take the top one out. One, two. Four. Same thing. Uh, oh, this thing's a little bit different. You push this thing in and push it down. And then I'll leave it in the back. Okay, baby. Okay, we had earlier we had a problem because this uh, plug is so short you can only pull this about two inches out like this. So I had to reach my hand in there and push some uh, butt. I mean some uh, the push button right here. Right here, you had to push this thing down like this and pull it out. Same as this, push down and pull it out. And the 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 hardest one in there was the I, I guess it's this one right here and. This one's a little bit longer, it's fine. Same thing, all of them are pushed down. So you have to reach in there, on top right here, push this thing up, and push, push that right here. Push one, pull it out, two, and then three. Then it'll come out okay. If not, you won't be able to get out this far right here. You literally got no room to, to pull it out. All right, well now we're gonna put the plug and play back in. Take the plastic out. We're gonna have to, we take a bunch of more screw out too right here. Completely. Uh, we it's plug and play, so we didn't really show the whole uh, procedure. So we got everything plugged in. Make sure all the wires plugged in, and you're good to go. I mean, just like I said, like it said, plug and play. The hardest part is get it all out. Bye. Bye, baby. So. Bye, Dad.
บายบายเอ๊ะเอ๊ะมาเตะชูโม่มีเกตเตอร์ thanks Right here. This is a stick shift. So once you got that last two, everything else just snap back right back in. Fun time. All right, time to play with this. Open that door up. Make sure this is on neutral. Turn the engine on. Not starting, but turn it on. So now you can put volume on. Up, down. Paradise. Just switching channel, so I'm. I don't want to play with that. I'm gonna play with setup. Actually, I'm gonna go home. Click on home. Now you can navigation, phone link, USB, and media. Basically, the media you play it from your phone, and it play right there. And then I Link Pro. I'm not sure what that is, but it's almost like you plug it to your from your phone because there's got a two plug right here. Media and iLink Pro right here. It say iLink Pro, so you pluck that, it should play with that. That's that's a nice sound setup system. So.